Love is in the air, Lainey, and it seems like Ben Affleck has also got his groove back. A special lady joins him at the premiere for his new movie, Triple Frontier, and in our new interview, Chloe finds out why he's living his best life. Well, guys, congratulations. I like that you guys are coordinated. Thank you. I do love a good coordinated outfit. So this is not your We see typical... ourselves as the cheerleaders for the movie, really. You guys are the so cheerleaders. We wear the same uniform. Yeah. Interesting. Definitely. I see you guys as the as the ringleaders of the group. Definitely the cheerleaders. No. <laughs> That's uh, Pedro, Garrett, and Charlie are the, in charge. Yeah. We're just waving the pom-poms. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing a great job. He may be a reluctant ringleader, but the action thriller marks Ben's first project after a much publicized rehab stint back in March 2017. But there's no denying Ben is back, looking healthy and happy alongside his reignited flame, Lindsay Shookus, who is spotted on the sidelines at his big premiere. You guys all look so great in this film. Did you guys incorporate, you know, what you learned from the special forces training in your current health regime? There was definitely a teamwork aspect of it that was really inspiring. It was all really, really impressive. You cannot go back back to your normal life after tonight. As former Special Forces operatives who reunite to pull off the ultimate heist, we can't help but notice some similarities to pal Matt Damon's Ocean's Eleven squad. Triple Frontier crew versus Ocean's Eleven crew. Which do we think is stronger? Well, we're a lot younger. I don't know what that says. <laughs> Not without any judgment, you guys are terrific. A lot? The crew I can't speak to, but the cast. <laughs> I mean, you know, Cheadle, Clooney, Pitt, Damon, you're talking about a median age of 64. <laughs> and uh, so, you know, we, we have the youngest guys in town, but you know what I mean? <laughs>